Hey guys, this is a skin tutorial I'm going to be doing for an original fan art of Bamboo Blade I'm doing. This is Kirino from Bamboo Blade. Um, I'll start off by telling you what colours I'm going to use. Uh, putty for the darker tone. So I'm going to be using three colours, maybe maybe even four. It just depends how it goes. But I'll just show you how I'll do it. And uh, Alright, so a mid-tone colour I'm going to be using is Satin. And a higher, lighter tone will be a Linen. So... The idea is to blend these together so that it creates a nice even tone around the whole face. But um, I'm going to choose a light source, so I'm going to be trying diagonal into uh, sort of, if that makes sense. But yeah, start off doing your darker tones. Obviously, it'll be shadowed by the hair, where the light's hitting the hair onto her face. And uh, just a bit below where the face curves, obviously. And just through the other side as well. Well, I'm just going to speed this bit up because I think you'll get the general idea of where the shadows would go from just what I'm drawing. Okay, once we've put down our darker tone, next is the mid-tone, um, just to blend over it so it mixes well. For this I'm going to be using satin. So just go over, again, where you've gone with the darker tone, just so it, when it's going into lighter shades it blends pretty well and all the colours are even. Uh, again, yeah, like I said, just apply it where you've gone with the darker tone. Uh, all around the face where you've put the darker tones and uh, this should hopefully create a nice blend. Well, I'm going to speed this bit up again um, so you get the general idea. Alright, next is the lighter tone which I'm going to be using linen, like I said. Uh, just again, again, I know it's repeating, but go over everything you've done again just so, like I said, it blends or better so it doesn't look like there's any streaks or that the colors are independent from each other just so it makes it look like they're all blending well together if that's just a lot of repeating what I'm saying but it will make it look better in the end so hopefully you like my technique or techniques I've learned from other artists but um, again I'm just gonna speed this up because it's the same thing repeating really Alright, like I said at the beginning, I was thinking of using another tone. Uh, the last tone I'm going to be using is Almond. Just so all the colours look much nicer, blend together better. Um, just with more tones in the in the skin. Just go over all your areas again and uh, cover all the white left in the face. I'm just going to speed this up and uh, you'll get the idea. Well, now to be honest with you, after all of that, it's pretty much essentially the same for the rest. I'm just going to do the neck as well. Um, just put where the shadows are, where your darkest tone, go over with your mid tone. And with your lighter tones, just mix all over what you've done. Just create a nice blend. Um, I'm going to be doing exactly the same with Tamaki, the character on the right. And um, the rest of the video will just be sped up. Hope you like it. If you have any questions or ways I can improve myself, just leave in the comment sections below. And sorry about the way my voice is, I'm a bit ill, so <laughs> hopefully you can excuse that. Also, I'm hoping to upload my actual original fan art time-lapse video I'm going to be doing on YouTube. And I uh, hope you like that video, plus I hope you like this video. But uh, thanks for watching, guys, and enjoy the rest of the video.